Oh, your mystery date. Oh, do I detect some jealousy? Me jealous? Ha! Ah, double ha! Ah, double ha! Ah. Hey, why is mine a panic button? Because she really does know you well. Okay, you're upset. I'm not upset. Then what are you? I am just a little bit uncomfortable with the new command structure. I don't like keeping secrets from my own people. You're sure this isn't about Sophia? No, why would it be? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because I based a character on her. Don't flatter yourself, Castle. It's not that big an honor. Good, because Sophia is on our side. We're on the same team. And that doesn't concern you? You don't think that that will undermine our unit cohesion? Hey, I am willing to let that slide in the interest of national security. Yeah, well, I guess I am, too. It's just, I might have been a little bit taken aback to find out that you had researched with someone else. Look, it was never the way it is with you and me. I just hung out with her for a while to lend some authenticity to Clara Strike. It was a brief moment a long time ago. And besides, Nikki Heat is a far more complex and nuanced a character. She is. And I'm a far more experienced writer. On tour. One out of two. Mm. So how long did the two of you hang out? A year. That's your idea of a brief moment. I was young and she had a lot to teach me. <laughs> yeah, I'll bet. <laughs> About the shadowy world of espionage. Let me ask you this. How many other women have you semi-stalked in the name of research? So... You slept with her? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I slept with her. Has there been others? Women? Muses. No. Why? I just wanted to see how big the club was, that's all. Hey, guys, what do you got? Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. First off, there is no club. And second, we're off the case, if you recall? We're off their case. I still have a murder to solve. Where your chief suspect is smack dab in the middle of a CIA operation. I don't care what he's in the middle of. Thomas Gage killed three people. One of them was in my custody. He locked us in a trunk and then he sent my cruiser to the bottom of the Hudson. Gage is a trained covert operative. There's no way you can catch him. Yes, I can. If I figure out where he was going. We find out what Blakely was working on. We find the linchpin. We find the linchpin. We find Gage. Anything on the warehouse? Yeah, right after you guys left, the feds showed up and shut us down. But we did find something on you, Vic. Nelson Blakely? His prince came back as a Scott McGregor from Long Island City. Problem is, McGregor seems to only exist on paper. We can't find any trace of him in the real world. Did you guys send units to the listed address? Yeah, and the family living there had never heard of him. No one recognized his photo. Well, someone must have known him. Someone did. He plays chess. That's not a solo sport. I thought you were off the case. You heard what Sophia said. I'm a reckless, immature, self-centered jackass. If you're stupid enough to keep going, I'm stupid enough to go with you. All right, you guys canvas all of the chess parks in the city. Let's see if we can dig up some of his opponents. Beckett. What? What do you mean the body never arrived? They intercepted it in transport. Apparently, they had a court order. That's impossible. How could they get a court order that fast? I don't know. Maybe you should ask your girlfriend. Girlfriend? Yes, okay, we slept together. It was a long time ago. What's the big deal? There is no big deal. Sleep with whoever you want. The more, the merrier. <clears throat> I have those, uh, toxicology reports you wanted? Oh, yes, just set them there, sweetie. Thank you. Has anyone seen Detective Beckett? going out? That pulled some strings that got us into a party at the British consulate tonight. Nigel will be there. We'll get his prints and he won't even know it. Cheers, lads. Or they could do that. Yeah, sure. I'll do it the easy way. And uh, that's pretty much where we are. What about the security footage that Hayes was looking at from two weeks ago? If the killer 
had cased out the exhibit. Maybe he's on that video. Mm. Yo, guys, found something. I was going over the security. Oh, Detective Esposito, this is Serena Kay. She's with us. Okay. Where are you going? Uh, I'm not a cop either. So. Fine. Oh, another jaunt into Manhattan's seedy underbelly? Come in. Sorry, no need for God Friday on this one. I'll just be making phone calls, boring stuff. And I'll catch you later? Catch me anytime. Hey. You find anything? No. Huh. You really want to nail this chick, don't you? Yeah, well, it's what we do, isn't it? Catch bad guys? Yeah, but seems like it might be about more than that. Just keep looking, okay? The skyline suite. Hey! What? What are you doing here? Arresting you for theft and murder. Wait, so now you're telling me that you don't believe she's in on this? Why would she tell me she's a thief? Why offer that up? Because she's feeding you just enough truth so that swallowing the lies is easier. I don't think she's behind this. Yeah, well, you're thinking with the wrong body part. It was only a kiss. I was doing what you told me to, keeping her occupied. I was trying to give you enough time so that you could search her room. Yes, the room. The room where we found the suitcase and the email, which all stands as evidence against her right now. I just think we should give her a chance to explain. We? No, there is no way we're going in on the interrogation together. Oh, come on. I'm sorry, Castle. But right now, based on this conversation and your behavior in that hotel, it is obvious you have been compromised. I was only doing... But you last. She's an uncooperative, cocky, stubborn know-it-all. But she is good at her job. No, yeah, well, Castle seems to think so. And that bothers you? Yes, of course it bothers me. Why? Because he's supposed to be... Be what? My partner? I mean, he's supposed to be on my team. He's not supposed to be all smitten. Why is it complicated? You know why it's complicated. Only what you've told me. Kate, what are you really scared of? That he won't wait for you? Or that he will? <laughs> well, that was that was the last time I took my laptop into a coffee shop. <laughs> So, as a handsome, bestselling author, I'm sure you must have women throwing themselves at you all the time. Well, we all have our crosses to bear. <laughs> yes, you're such a martyr. So no one special in your life right now? Um, I, uh, no. Uh, actually, no, no one's special. I'm single right now. That's good, because there's a question I've been wanting to ask you. Will you have dinner with me tomorrow night? Oh, um, well, wow, I'm flattered. <laughs> but I have to decline. <laughs> Come on, Castle, there's only three seconds until commercial. I, uh... Exactly, I'm... what are you waiting for? Hello? We're gonna need an answer. No. Uh, actually, I would love to. It's a date. Great. <laughs> Frozen Heat, it's on bookshelves now. We'll have more with Richard Castle after the break. What? Your ex-wife is here. Meredith? Huh? Hello, kitten. Uh, what, what are you doing here? Alexis. Oh, my poor baby. Aren't you supposed to be in Paris? Not without my daughter. And since you can't go to Paris, I'm bringing Paris to you. French pastries and funny face. We can enjoy them as I nurse you back to health. Uh, Meredith, how, why, why so much luggage? believe that you are actually letting your ex-wife stay with you with us what was i supposed to do stick her a hotel yes 
Look, I get her taking care of Alexis, but staying at your place? Okay, wait, hang on. I turned to you, I said, is it all right with you? And then you said yes. What am I supposed to say? Everyone is looking at me. I'm not meant to be the bad guy in this case. You are. Besides, I gave you the look. What look? The look, look. My look. Please don't tell me after four years you don't actually know the look. You gotta understand. You know what? I'm not talking about this right now. Good morning, Lainey. Not from the way you sound. What's wrong? Men are clueless. Men or just castle. Is this you being jealous? <laughs> jealous? Yes. The guy won a MacArthur Genius Award. You know who they give those awards to? Geniuses. Okay, he's got one company bringing clean water to Africa and another one that might actually cure cancer. So yes, when you're in a room with him alone, I'm a little jealous. Ryan, we gotta go over that video again. There's gotta be something in it that'll help us figure out who he is. Looks as though you two were enjoying yourselves. Castle. What about pajamas? Only flannel or skimpy sleep shorts? Oh my gosh, you're sounding like my dad dropping me off at summer camp. Did they serve champagne at your summer camp? I was being polite. Castle, do you think I want this? Do you think I asked to be here? I think you're making the best of it. You know I would rather be with you. Well, then, maybe I should stay. We could protect him together. No, I am not letting you do this. I'm not letting you turn this investigation into some kind of a twisted competition. Look, don't make this harder than it needs to be, please. Okay, but only because you said please. Well, it's obvious that you and I are not going to resolve this. So you concede? Seriously? Who liked who first? That's right. Who is into whom first? Me or Castle? You do realize that I'm busy I'm trying to save your life. Just answer the question, Espo. Don't be afraid to hurt his feelings. And don't forget about how jealous she got that time we worked that case at Max Scorpion's wedding. Or how jealous he got when I was with Deming. Or before that, how jealous she got about me and my ex-wife. Who are you talking to? Or how about when you wrote that sex? It's Castle and Beckett. I think they're starting to crack. Check it out. Or uh, jealous about me and Serena Kay or Sophia from the CIA. Wait, Shaw from the FBI. Or how about yeah, well, you wrote that totally losing it. Yeah. So whatever happens, whatever you decide, Catherine Houghton Beckett, Catherine Houghton Beckett, will you marry me? Oh my God. Oh my God, you're proposing. Okay, you're surprised. Of course I'm surprised. I thought you were breaking up with me. Are you offering you a ring? Well, you just, you seem so serious. Yeah, of course I'm serious. This is the most serious thing I've ever done. Oh, God. So that's a yes? No, wait. No. No, 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 not, not no. So yes. Castle, I love you. But this is my shot. And if I don't do this, I'll always regret it. Look, if this changes anything for you, if this changes the way that you feel... Kate, I'm not proposing to you to keep you here or because I'm afraid I'm gonna lose you. I'm proposing because I can't imagine my life without you. If that means when things get difficult, we have to figure them out, then I'm willing to figure them out, assuming you're willing to figure them out with me. Well, in that case, Richard Edgar Alexander Rogers Castle, yes. Richard Edgar Alexander Rogers Castle, yes. Yes. I will marry you. <sighs> Big. Oh, you just have remarkably tiny fingers. We're gonna be able to make this work, right? We're gonna be great. DC is gonna be great. <laughs> I promise.